Support Wrestle Talk. Give us a subscribe. Hello and welcome to the Wrestle Talk News. I'm Ollie Davis. Earlier in the week, Sports Illustrated reported that former WWE champion Rey Mysterio will soon become one of the hottest free agents in wrestling. With his Lucha Underground contract expiring in September, and both WWE and GFW, the former TNA, are negotiating with him. Following Raw on Monday night in Nashville, the base of GFW's operations, Impact star Conan tweeted a photo of him hanging out with R-Truth, who used to wrestle for TNA, and a maskless Ray. And later on, GFW's Karen Jarrett, who happens to be the wife of the promotion's executive producer, Jeff Jarrett, posted her own selfie with Mysterio on Instagram. PW Insider explains this is because Ray was in Nashville earlier that day to negotiate a deal with Global Force Wrestling. And that he currently has a contract offer in his hands. Pursuing Mysterio is a wise move by GFW, not just for his name value, but also because their main Latino star, Alberto El Patron, the former Alberto Del Rio in WWE, is currently suspended, despite being their world champion. TMZ reported he roughed up a female companion at an airport last week, and the Orlando Police Department confirmed Jose Rodriguez Rodriguez, Alberto's real name, was under investigation for a domestic violence battery incident. His fiancée Paige defended El Patron on Twitter, blaming an unnamed woman for starting the issue. Despite this, Alberto is still being advertised for GFW's live events next month, their first touring house shows in over a year. But Jeremy Borash has since noted El Patron isn't confirmed for the dates, as the company is still investigating the incident themselves. Alberto has been stripped of one title though, the World Association of Wrestling Heavyweight Championship which the promotion has declared as vacant. WAW is run by Paige's family, and following reports of the airport incident last week, her brother Zach claimed on Facebook, she's with a control freak who think he's a tough guy cause he beats my sister and has money to cover his tracks. Which makes the story's latest development all the more worrying and confusing. A representative for the Orlando Police Department has confirmed to Pro Wrestling Sheet that detectives have found that probable cause exists to charge Soraya Bevis, Paige, with battery, domestic violence. Their findings have been sent to the state attorney's office and it will be up to them whether to charge her. Alberto is still reportedly under investigation. This is just the latest controversy in the last year period of Paige's WWE career, which includes two wellness policy violations and subsequent suspensions, her fiance Alberto constantly badmouthing her employer in public, reported clashes with the company over whether or not she needed neck surgery, showing up in the audience for other wrestling promotions, and the sex tape hack. If this were anyone else, you'd expect WWE to wish them well in all their future endeavors. But with Paige, there's a catch. Rob the Dwayne Johnson and WWE Studios are currently producing a movie based on her life which they'd presumably like to have her under contract for when it's released. But recent events might make WWE's decision for them. As per their domestic violence policy, upon arrest for such misconduct, a WWE talent will be immediately suspended. So if Paige is arrested for the count, that would make it her third suspension in under a year. The rule is three wellness policy violation strikes and you're out. Paige already has two, and WWE WWE could decide a mixture of those and the domestic violence suspension is enough to terminate her contract. But if she's actually convicted for the misconduct, WWE's domestic violence policy states the talent will be immediately terminated. Brock Lesnar is reportedly leaving WWE, and how many things are wrong with the Kurt Angle Jason Jordan storyline? Find out in the videos to the left, press subscribe, and support WrestleTalk on Patreon. I've been Ollie Davis, and that was wrestling.